and I'm sincere about that, I have at least 500 more videos than me, not counting lives. I'm talking about just really fascinating, interesting things that I believe that you can't find on YouTube. Uh, like I'll, give you, I'll give you an example. I was pretty upset to find that somebody got 750,000 views on a Mithridates video where the whole video was really cartoonish and it sucked and it was talking about the meteorite that stopped the armies. My own Mithridates video went into ex exquisite detail, has really good graphics and maps. I show you where it happened, what was going on, and I gave you some really good tantalizing historical facts about this enigmatic figure named Mithridates IV who had basically organized the greatest defeat Rome had ever, ever experienced. And he did it without an army. He's fantastic. The Romans hated this man and spent, they spent, in our equivalent today, they spent billions hunting him. So, yeah, he organized, he organized the execution of 81,000 Romans in a blink. And he did it without an army. He's, he wired up the people. But he organized the people. King, the King of Pontus. Fascinating story. I put all this in the video. The video is one of my least watched videos, but it's about the meteorite. It's called the meteorite that changed history. Yeah, it's one of my older videos, and it's not, not, not as good as my newer videos, but still, the information is fantastic because I'm showing that this is not the first time it's happened where history was about to be decided and suddenly the simulacrum did something to alter alter the trajectory it's happened more than you believe where vast armies were about to come together and suddenly something stopped and changed the whole trajectory of the battle in this instance it was a rock that fell out of the sky so uh anyway i was kind of upset when i saw i was going through youtube and i saw that some guy just two months ago released some video over the same thing, crappy, wasn't near as informative as mine, and got 750,000 views. I was pissed. Then again, I, I understand. I mean, I understand. It's, uh, it's, it's, YouTube's owned by the enemy, as simple as that. So, I get it. I get it. That's why every single one of my videos is 100% backed up. If my YouTube channel ever goes down, I'll find somewhere else. And within two or three days, every one of my videos will be uploaded somewhere else. It's no big deal.